In this tutorial, I will explain you how to use the flattened surface in SOLIDWORKS. So let's begin. Open a part file guys, click part and click OK then. And from here, select top plane and click on sketch. And this is the option for the spline and make here a spline like this. And guys, uh, although I'm not going to be fully defined this sketch by using this uh, smart dimensioning tool but uh, here's my advice for you to always fully define sketches give all dimension it required but in this tutorial I am not going to be fully defining it just to save your time so uh, from here you can enable the surfaces tab from here and this is the tab for the surfaces select the extrude command and you can extrude it from here or either you can specify the dimension and check this box from here so just to better visualize it I'm assigning it some material and now we are ready for the surface flatten just select the surface flatten command from here and then we need to select this face it is appeared here and in the next window we need to select an edge and the surface will get flattened about that edge we can delete this from here and select any other one for example this one or any other edge we can delete it from here and select any other edge so we can do it for this tutorial i will be choosing this edge and we have one more option available for the mesh that is actually dimensional accuracy if you can see this if i increase this from here this will actually increase the dimensional accuracy now if you see this surface guys this is turned into black one but this is not actually black this has increased the mesh size basically so it means that we gonna have better dimensional accuracy for example if the real length of line is 15 it will give us 15 and not 14.9 or 8 so we gonna have better dimensional accuracy so this is it for this video guys i have covered all the surface modeling commands uh, in a playlist i will provide the link in the description you can check that out as well